Hello, so uh, today let's uh, take a tackle a problem which I think I've mentioned in a past video, but I don't think I really went over um, how to fix that. So let's go over here and take a look. So basically, my computer is set up. I have uh, one that's just a flash card, but I have one, two, three, four hard drives. So the local disk C here, which is the main hard drive, is the one running the OS, only has 120 gigabytes, or actually 118 available, and I only have 6.88 gigabytes free. And that's after deleting a bunch of programs and everything on there. E is where I'm having Steam install the games and everything, and this is where I save all my download files, and I have pictures, uh, that are related to those apps and then over here I have a drive full of videos and it actually has a few work things on there this was the newest one I added and this is one that you guys see me all the time going into and got it's got my YouTube uh, stuff on there but basically I want to move my hard drive here or my programs which are in the C drive here my SSD and I want to put some of them over here where I have almost 600 gigabytes free and I can actually also make some more room on there. There's a lot of junk on there. Um, but it can be challenging. Like with these folders here, you know, your your desktop, your documents, your downloads, all that. It's very simple. You can actually right click, click on them, go to properties and you can go to location and you can just change the file in here and so then it's basically just like a link only thing is with the program files if we go in here it's this file if we go to properties uh, we don't have really that kind of option right so how we got to do or how we're going to do that is we're going to use the registry editor so the first thing you want to do is you want to go to your local drive C and this is something that's you know what I'm gonna close all programs so that it doesn't write anything end task end task yeah let's just close all this okay now the only thing running is my OBS, uh, which is writing into a different dr drive, so it should be fine. So basically, you want to just copy these two folders here. You don't really have to do this, I guess, like as if it's a new install or something. But I am going to copy these folders from the C drive over here. I'm going to paste. And this is going to take a little bit of time. Let's continue. And it's a lot there. It's going to be, I don't know, maybe 80 gigabytes or something. Uh, and it's a copy, so it's going to take a while. It's off of the main hard drive, which we're still using. So it's definitely going to take some time. So I don't know. What are we going to do? Uh, I'll speed this up for you guys. Okay, and we're finally finished here. So what we want to go do now is now the directories are the file names are the same. It's just on a different drive. So the main two that you want to kind of look at is here the program file dir and the x86 here. So we go modify and you just want to change that from C to what was it again we were going to I believe it was E alright so we're gonna change that to E hit OK go with the 86 which is a 64 bit modify we want to change that to E as well now you can go in and the common files all these little things here uh, those there are going to um, 
change like the the small files on there, but the main portions, uh, the main portions. So if we go over here and you know you go to apps, um, you know the main portions here that you see are taking up a lot of uh, space here. If we go to C, you know I've got. Uh, let's go by file size. So you know Office is 1.15. You got Hit Express, Hit Film Express, which is nine. 81 all of these apps which are taking a lot of space here we can now have them installed on the e drive instead of the c drive so it's not going to eliminate everything and i haven't noticed any issues since um doing that so i'm going to restart the computer and see what happens okay so we restarted the computer um i actually did end up going and I changed all the registries to E just so that I could delete these folders here. Um, yeah, so I deleted, I'm deleting all these folders here. Uh, we'll do one more restart, make sure things don't work. One thing to keep in mind is do make a backup. Uh, before you much start messing with the reg registry editor, uh, always make a backup. You don't know. You never know. Um, it can potentially brick your computer. Your computer will be F you two more letters. You will be fact. Um, if you screw with a registry incorrectly and screw things up, it's possible that your computer won't even start up. And then you would have to find some alternate way to reinstall everything and you'll lose all your information. So just make sure to make a backup of your drive um, just to make sure you have some way to revert back on it. Uh, but there you go. That's how you can change your register so that you can run your OS on your solid state drive and then put all your applications in the other drive. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you found this helpful. And if you did, make sure to click the like button and I will see you around.